Hey there, you guys, it's me, and we're back for another online clogging lesson, a clogging lesson that you can learn to do at home. My name is Brian Bond, and I am the director of Powerhouse Percussive Dance, one of the most prolific clogging uh, companies in the country. We've been on more TV shows than any other clogging group in the country. Everything from Hee Haw to America's Got Talent to The Gong Show, and recently we just appeared on Tengo Talento, Mucho Talento. You can find that video in my links on our channel. And by the way, subscribe to my channel because we're gonna have more great instructional videos. We're gonna have interviews starting up with nationally rec recognized cloggers from all over the country. Um, people from the old days where that helped us get it all started and people from now that are rocking the competition scene and performance scene with clogging, amazing clogging steps. Well today, I want you to make sure you're safe. When we do these lessons, I want you to make sure the floor space is completely clear around you. Make sure there's no obstacles. If you don't have clogging shoes, you can do this dance still. You, I mean, you can do these steps still. Just make sure you're wearing good, solid tennis shoes and that they're tight, tight. No flip-flops, no sandals, and please, no bare feet. Um, you can even do it on carpet if you want to get, just for, to get started. But as you progress, you're obviously gonna wanna get some tap shoes or clogging shoes so you can make some of those fun sounds that we love to make with clogging, right? Today's lesson is gonna be four ways to do leg lifts. Now, depending on where you are in the country, these steps might have different names and terminology. I just wanna say, my way is not gonna be the only way. But there's, and there's a lot of good ways around the country, but I do believe my way is easily accessible and a lot of fun. So, let's get ready to do this. Now, we've already done singles, uh, triples, and all that good stuff. So a leg lift is the most complicated of the basic steps because it involves your legs moving in opposition as opposed to the other ones where you're moving straight forward and at the same way at the same time. When I say in opposition, it's almost like the legs are moving like a pair of scissors, opposite and then back together. So, what I want you to do is I'm gonna do a mirror image. I will start with my left foot. You will start with your right, that's so we look like a mirror. And all you're gonna do is you're gonna step down with that left foot and bring your right knee up, up. So it's gonna go one, two, other side go. One, two, other side go. One, two, other side go. One, two, good. We're gonna do four of those in a row. Okay, here we go, without stopping. Our four step lifts. We're gonna call these leg lifts. Ready, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's try it one more time. Left foot first. We're gonna add that clap that I did. Um, it's gonna create a little dynamic energy. You wanna pull your knee up, what I call tabletop, so it's flat like a table as you lift it. Five, six, ready, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now, there's another way. The next way I'm going to teach you is to do a, one, a step and a chug on the same foot. Now, a chug's where we slide back and forward, but we're going to do that on one foot. So it's going to go step and chug. So you step down on your left foot. As you lift up your right foot, you're going to go backward and then forward. Try it again. Ready, go. Step and chug. Other side, go. Step and chug. Other side, go. One more time. Good. We're going to do four in a row. If you have a little bit of difficulty balancing, feel free to hold on to something. A chair next to you. Don't lean on it, but use it to help you balance, right? Five, six, four, leg lifts with the chug. Step and chug, step and chug, step and chug, step and chug. So let's put the step lift and the step and chug together. Left foot. Five, six, ready, go. Up, step, up, step, up, now add a chug, step, chug. Okay, so far so good. Let's do it one more time. Five, six, ready, go. Step, up, step, up, now add a chug. Left, right, left, right. Perfect. All right, so. Now, like I said, these are the most, most difficult ones, so be careful when you're trying these. The next one we're gonna do is add a kick to it. We're gonna step down with our left, we're gonna kick our right, and then lift it up. So it's gonna go step, kick, up, step, kick, up. I'll stand at an angle so you can see my foot move. Uh, left foot first, ready, go. Step, kick, up, step, kick, up, step, kick, up, step, kick, up. One more time, left foot first. Five, six, ready, go. Step, kick, up, 
Step kick up. Step kick up. Step kick up. Now we're going to take that step kick up. And feel free to rewind this and walk and do that a couple times if you need a little extra help with it. We're going to take that step kick up and we're going to add that drag slide chug to that. Step and chug. So as you go down with your left foot, you're going to step. As you kick with your right foot, you're going to slide back. And as you lift it up, you slide forward. So we're doing the lift and the kick and the chug all at the same time. And this is a two count step. Ready, go. Step, kick up. Try your right foot. Step, kick up. Try your left foot. Step, kick up. Try your right foot. Good. Four in a row. Step, kick up with a chug. Five, six. Ready, go. One and two. Three and four. Five and six. Seven, eight. So far, we have three ways to do these. Three ways to do leg lifts. The first one is just a step lift. The second one is a step and chug. Don't worry about your top leg. The third one, we add the kick and the lift. So let's do all three of those ways so far. We'll keep it slow, low impact. Five, six, ready, slow. Step up, three, four, five, six. Now add a chug. One and two. Add a kick. Step, kick up, step, kick up, step, kick up, step, kick up. I'm gonna do it one more time at an angle just so you can see the way my feet are kicking and moving at the same time. Here we go, left foot, five, you got this, five, six, left foot, go. Step up, step up, step up, add a chug, step, chug, add a kick. Boom! So far, so good, you guys. You're doing great. All right, well, in our other steps, we worked on shuffle steps, five ways to do shuffle steps. Now, shuffle steps, like I said, is the meat and bones. It is the bulk, the core of most tap and clogging steps. And that is that nice, fast, clean metal sound front back step. So do one shuffle step on your left. Ready, go. Ready, go. Left foot, go. One more time. Right foot, left foot go. Right, I'm sorry, right foot go. Right foot go, that's it. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna add that move to our leg lifts, whoa. You can do this. We're gonna go very slow. You're gonna start with your left foot. You're gonna do your shuffle step. Then you're gonna kick and slide and then bring it up on that back chug. So you're gonna do the chug, on the front chug, I mean. So try it again, left foot, ready, go. Shuffle step, kick up. I'll do it at an angle. Left foot again. Ready and shuffle step, kick up. Right foot go. Shuffle step, kick up. Other side go. Shuffle step, kick up. Other side go. So we're gonna do four of those in a row. Da 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 da. Two counts. Watch me do it first. Now I'll tell you, a lot of cloggers call these chugs because you chug up with your leg, your bottom foot's doing chugs. I don't call them chugs, I call them leg lifts, but you can call them whatever you want, right? There's no rule in clogging that says you have to name it a certain way. So let's just have fun. We'll call them leg lifts for now. Four leg lifts, adding a shuffle step. Five, six, shuffle step, left foot, shuffle one and two, three and four, five and six, seven, eight. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put all four of those ways together without music. Then we're gonna do it with music medium speed and with music fast. You are the boss of your clogging. You get to decide how difficult you want to make it and you've gotta to listen to your body. If you are 50 years old and you've never danced before and today's your third or fourth lesson, you don't have to do all those chugs. Just get your, your muscle memory used to moving. But if you are 50 and you've been dancing for 20 years and you want to make it harder, do it. If you're 15 and you're real young and strong, throw yourself into it. You decide your level, okay? So four ways to do leg lifts. Step lift, step and chug, sh uh, step kick lift, shuffle step kick lift. Five, six, left foot slow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven,
seven, add a chug. One and two, three and four, five and six, add a kick. Step, kick up, step, kick up, step, kick up, step, shuffle, step. Boom! Nice job, you guys. All right, you guys. So I found some royalty-free music that you can use, but you can dance to any music you want, any style, pop, country, bluegrass, I don't care. Just have some fun. Now I'm gonna count you in. We're gonna do these leg lifts. One, two, three, four, five, six, leg lift, go. Step up, step up, step up, at a chug. Step, drag, slide, step, drag, slide, step, back, front, at a kick. Fantastic leg lifts under our belt. So, so far in all our videos, we have shuffles, we have singles, we have triples, we have leg lifts. Now, you guys, we're gonna do one or two more videos and then we're gonna put them into a full routine that you can do at home. Super easy. Here's what I want you to do. Just take your finger like this, take that, put it on the mouse, drive it around and click subscribe. Subscribe to my channel. Not only for great instruction videos, but again, those interviews, all the TV shows, live events we're going to do. Ladies and gentlemen, we hope you had fun today. Stay safe, and I'll see you next time. Woo-woo!